Good morning, my visionary dreamers. Adion here, another self accountability video. Today is day, I think, 19. Wow, we made it this far. And if you've been following, I hope you got a lot out of these little videos. Today, we're going to talk about delete or pause. Delete or pause. Do you go through your phone, go through your uh, friends on social media? I think it's time for us to start looking if we need to delete or pause certain people out of our life or put them on pause. The reason why is because every new year, we're getting close to the new year, um, we always make these resolutions on how we claim we're going to be different. Well, the thing is this, a lot of times the way we can be different is to really observe our friendships, really observe the people that's in our lives because they say the total five closest friends or closest people in your life is basically you, you know what I mean? It kind of makes up you, who you are, how you think, uh, how you move and things of that nature. So I say to you guys, you know, today take the time to really think about it. Go through your phone. I have like 800 and something contacts in my phone. I don't even talk to 800 and something people. A lot of it is business. But, you know, when you start really looking at who you are connected to, you start looking back at your life. Let's say take the last 10 years of your life or maybe even the next last five. If you can't remember 10. What does that look like to you? How have you been since the last 10 years of your life? And who was in your circle through the last 10 years of your life? How have you grown? How have you went backwards? Think about that. And then look at the people. Who has allowed you to grow and help you to move forward from having that connection? And who is it in your life that continues to keep you in a mindset of moving backwards or standing still and this can be family members friends you know associates co-workers things of that nature so that's why I say to you delete a pause because sometimes some people just need a pause while they work on themselves you working on yourself because we all have the ability to change no matter how old we are I could look at the last 10 years of my life and I'm amazed at how much growth I've made how much I've changed I, I put a lot of people on pause when I stayed at a yoga meditation retreat for eight to nine years. And that was the, I mean, eight to nine months. And that was the best time of my life. I was in solitude. I did talk to a few people, but I really discovered me. And I came out knowing who I needed to delete and who I needed to put on pause. You get what I'm saying? And that allowed those people that I need to put on pause to go on their journey and to learn about themselves. So when the time is right, you can reconnect or maybe never reconnect. You get what I'm saying, guys? But the bottom line is this. Who are you today? Who do you want to become? Who were you yesterday? Are you the same person yesterday as you are today? Because if you are, you need to reevaluate yourself, your circle. Even if you feel like you're good, Sometimes you can meet even more new people that allows you to grow even more. You hear what I'm saying, guys? So with all that being said, get to your phone, your contacts, your social media, your friends. Befriend some people, put some people on pause, and totally delete some people, no matter who it is. It's about you guys. When you get you together, then guess what? Your surroundings can become better people in your circle and people in your lives and now we all can grow together i love you guys i really do take the time reevaluate comment below subscribe like share if you get anything out of this video i love 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 you guys this is adion until tomorrow